Sam. Um, this is my uh, books that I've read um, this month. I only read two. And one's a poem book. One's a, I think, a kid's book. And, yeah, I didn't read that much this month. Mainly because of... I had so much to do this month. It was, like, not a slump. I just thought I had so much to do this month that it was, like, crazy. <laughs> Give me a minute. I'm trying to pull them out that way I could show you. Yeah, I just wanted to show you the uh, bag that I, like, you know, am using right now. It says Day of the Dead. It's an old Halloween bag. Oops, sorry. <laughs> I'm trying to pull this one out. That's so big. Okay. Um... Well, that's not the one I read first. It's this one, yeah. Brother of the Wolves by John, Jean Thompson, illustrated by Steve Marchi, Marchese. Um, this is actually a really good book. I I was gonna give this to Patricia, but I don't think she would like it, mainly because something bad happened into it, and she loves animals. So, yeah, I don't think that I might give this to her. I mean, I'll ask her to see if she still wants it, but I don't think that I'm going to give this to her. This is just for boys, but my niece Patricia likes stories, and this is just about a boy. She'll read about a boy's, you know, so. It ain't really focused toward boys. Girls can read it, too. It's an old library book. Um, yeah, I'm just showing you some illustrations that in it. Oh, I didn't even notice that was in there when I was reading it. Stamped right on the picture. <laughs> but, yeah, this one I actually did kind of like. Except for just a few little things here and there. Mainly because of that one bad thing happening with uh, one of the wolves. I'll just say that. <laughs> And how they treat him at first. But yeah, that one's a good one. And then I did read this. The Ideal's Treasury of Best Loved Poems by a whole bunch of different authors. Um, well, people who write poems. <laughs> uh, so far I've actually noticed that I've read two of the unwrapped unwrappings. Because I unwrapped that one and then I unwrapped that one. So, wow. <laughs> I guess I'll show you some pictures in this one. I did like this one. See, it's got like little, mainly just little flowers. Just a big picture of a tree. And it's, it does have, uh, it says edited by Patricia A. Pingree, so... My niece did this. That's the only page she did it to, too. Uh, it's just got like a whole bunch. Like it's like cut off into sections. Uh, it's got nature poems, words of courage, poems for families, light verses, poems of love, poems to tell a story, and poems to inspire. I honestly don't really, you know, remember. I mean, it was like spread out which ones that I liked the most. You know, I can't remember if it was Poems for Families. I mean, because it was this one that I actually did like the most. Oh, wait, I think you should actually see this one. This one's kind of cute. Ew, doggy. <laughs> yeah, that's all I've read this month. I did pick another one from I Am Still Reading um, Cravings and uh, the, what was it? Craving the Still Brothers. You know, that, that one, the, my Kindle, and then I'm still reading Pure, Pure Murder by Corey Mitchell. I'm still reading those two, uh, but I've decided to go ahead and pick uh, one of the, t the unwrappings one, and I picked this one. I am going to start reading this one. I was going to grab one of the Love Inspired, but I wasn't really feeling up to it but after I read this one I probably will and I did get a new bookmarker it is a for real wooden one it's um 
All I need today is a whole lot of Jesus. It is a religious -y one. The only reason, they had like a bunch of different ones, but I didn't, they were all religious ones, but I didn't actually like them too much. This is the only one I liked because of the um, three crosses up there. Yeah, I can't get wait to get to this one, and I also wanted just because I've uh, read two of them, I kind of wanted to replace them. I know I just um, did an unwrapping, so this might not make sense to some people, but I actually did want to kind of like um, replace them. I might start doing like I'll do two every month unwrappings. Well, two for me, two for the kids. But if I actually read more, like, of them than just one, like, if I just read one, then I'm not going to do this. But if I read two or more of the ones that I unwrap, I will do this. I might start doing that. I don't know. Um, this one, the only reason I wrapped it in this one, this is just a magazine. I, don't, I think it might have came from the same magazine. I'm not sure because it feels different. The only reason I chose this one is because of, um, I actually recognize a lot of the actors actresses and actors that's on this that's um jillian anderson i couldn't remember her name for a minute i think I, she's on um the x files and she's on i think she's on a bunch of other stuff too most famous for the x files that's meryl streep duh it says it right there uh off the top of my head i'm trying to remember a movie she's played in hmm huh. My mind's blanking, and that is shocking, because I know I got some movies from her. I got a comedy with her in it, but I can't remember the comedy. You guys tell me, what has she played in? <laughs> and then it has a whole bunch of these, um, what is her name? I can't remember. Uh... Faye something. The Faye Dunaway, maybe? I cannot remember her last name. I remember Faye, but last name's blank. I do know her, but it's like, I know a lot of actors and actresses. That's her in Dearest, uh, Mommy Dearest, was it? Yeah, I was making sure. And then that's her in Magic, um, what is that movie? Don, Don Juan? The only reason I know, I know, I know, uh, um, I'm like forgetful today. I know him. <laughs> oh my god. I'm trying to look his name up on the, um, paper. Oh, I can't. Johnny Depp, there we go. I remember I sang John, and then I was trying to remember his last name. His last names were bad for me. That's Jack Nicholson right there. She played in a movie with him. I've never seen that movie. I've never seen Chinatown. Yeah, that's the reason I, I don't know that movie. And then I think that's... No, that's her in a movie called The Network. That's Supergirl. I didn't even need to look over here. I already knew what this was because of that. I've never seen this either. Uh, that's Columbo. I, I love that show. Uh, I think it's just a picture of her. And then that's her, uh, doctor show. But I, was it ER? I don't know. It doesn't say. I don't know whether it's like ER or what. Because there's so many doctor shows. That's just her, like, on the red carpet. Um, yeah, I just picked it because I recognized them. Although, yeah, I know Meryl Streep and I know I've got movies with her in it, but it's, like, bl blanking what I've got of her because I have like so many movies that that's going to kill me until I actually I might have to look her up but yeah I'll just do it I'm wrapping this one first I think this is about planet girl or something Planet Girl, yep. Yeah. This is a book that I won on uh, Goodreads. 
It's Charlie, Charlie Joe's Jackson's Guide to Planet Girl. This is basically... This might be a reread for me. I'm not sure. Um, this is basically... Because I did actually uh, wrap up some of the ones of these, uh, the ones I want off of Goodreads. Because my friends and family sl are slowly starting to give them back to me. Because, yeah, some of them are borrowing them. So that's the reason you haven't seen them on the video if I've read them. But, uh... Which doesn't bother me, you know. That's the reason I can't remember if I've read this one or not. I'm trying to remember. Okay. Tommy Greenwald and illustrated by J.P. Covert. Boys are clueless. I think this is just, it's just like Diary of a Wimpy Kid. I think this is just like Diary of a Wimpy Kid. It's just about this girl, a boy, who's trying to understand girls. I think he's also trying to get a girlfriend. I think he just finds out that the girl that he um, at first likes isn't who he thought she was. Okay, this one, okay, it's, it was like a, her face is on the other side, you know, on the other page. I think I got her face on another book. Um, but this is Shirley Temple. I did, like, do this because I, you can see the, um, pictures of her. It's her with her friend, and that is, uh, the guy off of Happy Days, I think. It's just about his story. Yeah, this is from a different magazine. That other one felt way different than this. Yeah, this is just, uh, this is actually the reason that I bought the magazine in the first place. Because it had a, a secrets of her childhood, the Shirley Temple. You know, her friend, her, you know, talked about her. Okay. Is this another one? This is another one. This is another um, Goodreads giveaway. <laughs> this is probably, I think this is definitely a reread. Oops. Oh, well, I'll pick it up in a minute. Talked on the floor. Um, yep, this is a reread, I think. But it doesn't bother me. Um, I can't believe this. <laughs> uh, Fatal Pursuit. Uh, by Elizabeth Naughton. I think this is a part of a series. But I can read books out of order. I know most people can't. And they'd be like, why are you doing it? You gotta read the first one to understand the other ones. Not really, because I can easily go look up, like, you know, the series. And then it'll tell me about the series. And, yeah, this is a series. Extreme measures, lethal co um, consequences, and then fatal pursuit. Because it says the Agus series, and that's what this one is. The Agus series. And it says Against All Odds series, Stolen series, Eternal Guardian series, and Firebrand. Fire I was going to say Firebird. Firebrand series, and then Anthologies. I'm, if I like this, I can't, honestly, I can't remember this one. Um... Uh, that I might go after another one of hers. Um, yeah, it's by Elizabeth Naughton. If I didn't say that, I probably did. I'm trying to remember what this one's about. And I think it's about a, a yeah, I knew it. <laughs> I, had to, I was like army or something. A security op. Uh, five years ago, Agus Fury manager, Marley Addison, lover died, yeah. I kind of barely remembered that, like, um, Marley Addison's 
lover died and then she's or he oh my god why yes yeah she I don't know what makes a he but um well she thinks he's dead but he's not and she gotta figure out like what's going on basically this is like an action book. I'll just say that much. <laughs> I can't remember this one at all. That's the reason I'm looking at the back, and I cannot remember anything of this. And this is like a romancy book, so it's like action romance. Yeah, I can't wait to get to read these. And I can't believe they're both Goodreads giveaways books. And they're both, I think, from a long time ago, so. I'm looking. See what year. Jeez, yeah. 2015. But of course, it might, the one edition that I might got might have actually... I might not have got this in 2015. I think I got this later. Like, uh, they're trying to get... I think she's made another one and then they're, she's giving this one away. I do not remember. I know I got this one like later than 2015. This one's old. I can believe I got this one in 2015. Although I don't remember. No, it's 2015. Both of these are 2015. But I know, I don't think it was that long ago. But of course, but I don't think they were that old. I remember this one coming sooner because I started getting a whole bunch all at once of the giveaways that I entered. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. It is going to be kind of long and mostly me talking and everything. But, um, I'm trying to remember. I was going to say something. I did order a book. One book. <laughs> I'll show it to you when it comes in. At least I'll try to if I don't forget. Or something happens. But most likely you'll see that in a wrap up as soon as I get it. Because I'm just going to go flying through it. <laughs> and and believe me, the one that I'm getting is not the only one I'm going to be getting of him. It's a biography. And it's not going to be the only one. I'm going to get like a, almost every one of the ones that was made of them. If it seems good enough, you know. i got to read about it and, and see how long the book is before I can decide if I want any more of them. Because the, so many people wrote biographies about him that I don't know, like, which ones to get, which ones not to get. And they all sound good. But I'm really going after the ones uh, that knew him. I am going to get a one of... Uh, I'm kind of torn because I don't know whether to get the audiobook or not of one of them. So, I'm st I want you guys to be surprised. That's the reason I'm not mentioning much. I hope you guys enjoy this video. And uh, like, comment, and subscribe. So, bye.